welcome to the GraphQL introduction course. In this course, I want you to learn GraphQL and I want to make it as simple as possible and as fast as possible. Uh, when I was learning GraphQL, I had I just went to the documentation and it's just very boring and there's a lot of BS there. So I want to just make a quick project to show you basically how it works, what is the gist of it. And um, yeah, that'll, that'll be it. We're going to make a small API. Uh, we're going to make an API for uh, movies, for example. And uh, this course is the first course in the series that I'm gonna make about uh, GraphQL. Actually, it's not a series, it's only two courses. The first one is going to be this one, backend, and then we're going to make GraphQL on the front end with React, all right? So here we're gonna do GraphQL with Node.js and JavaScript, and then we're gonna do GraphQL with the front end, okay? so. I'm going to show you what uh, GraphQL Yoga and what we're going to do. I'm going to also um, start working and I'm gonna open my iTerminal. All right, let me kill this. I'm gonna open my iTerminal. And let's create CD documents. And let's create a uh, uh, graph movie a uh, movie QL that's a better name all right movie QL and we do yarn in it yes version one description uh, movie database movie API with graph QL entry point repository let's create real quick a repository new repository Normal coders, movie, QL, and done. Initialize, git ignored, node.js, create repository, and we are good to go. All right, so for this project to work, we are going to install GraphQL Yoga. GraphQL Yoga is something like Create React App, basically, that helps you start your uh, GraphQL project as fast as you can. All right, so let's go inside and let's start installing Shite. Okay, so here we are. Back as a JSON and let's just pull from GitHub and we start. Enter, all right, and git pull origin master. All right, how much time? Three minutes, we're good. Okay, so now all we have to do is go to GraphQL Yoga, and as you can see, it says, uh, fully featured GraphQL server with focus on EC setup. That is what we want to do, EC setup. It comes with tons of shit, and this is what we're going to learn how to use. So we're gonna say yarn at GraphQL Yoga, and that's it. That's all we wanna do, all right? So, GraphQL is something super, super awesome. I really, really like it. Um, it's like my favorite so far. I'm, I think I'm not going to use REST anymore in most of my projects. I always see that GraphQL will be better. Um, it makes the backend development super easy and there is huge teams in, um, for example, in Prisma QL and in Apollo. Apollo has an incredible community, incredible team, and they're like these two huge companies pushing for GraphQL. Also, Facebook uses GraphQL. So, I mean, what else is not to love, okay? So that's it, guys. This was the setup of the project. I just wanted to say hello to you. It's been a while since I don't record. And that's it. We're gonna make a movie API with GraphQL, and we are going to kick some ass, all right? So requirements for this course are just be comfortable with Node.js, be comfortable with um, JavaScript, um, be comfortable with server and backend and console and whatever. And that's it. I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.